Got a nice little snow crab piece right there. And along with some boo. High quality H2O. Mmm, let me see you, darling. Man, lie, 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 lie. Man, lie, 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 lie. Man, lie, lie. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the belly of Sorelli. If you're new to my channel, welcome to Sorelli Eat. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe because we are eating over here. I decided to do just a mini seafood mukbang, and I have something new that I actually haven't eaten on my channel before. And it is crawfish, crawdads, um, you know, I don't know what else other people call them besides those two things. Um, I have a couple of pieces of shrimp in here, and then I have a cluster of snow crab. Um, not too big, you know, I kind of wanted to just do like a little question of the, of the video type thing and see how we do with that. Um, I do have some Cajun dip, and um, it says that it's mayonnaise. Um, Louisiana hot sauce and a little bit of ketchup just a little bit and then I have my jalapeno butter right there and along with some boo, high quality H2O uh, so like I said it won't be a super long video kind of want to just eat a little bit for the weekend for you because it is the weekend as you know so let's get it started here we go these were large shrimp at some point it's about as big as my pinky. But I got the Cajun dip sauce right there. Mmm. I won't complain. Hopefully your week was alright. Everyone eats these differently. Ooh. I can eat those little claws. So I know a lot of people peel like that and pull, um, but I'm kind of picky. I kind of take out the little sack that comes with it. I don't know. That's just my preference. But then you get this nice little piece of meat right there. Dip it in the Cajun. Oops. Little to no meat in this, but just bite it. Bite it and the meat comes out pretty, pretty easily. I don't know if I'm gonna be eating these the entire video or if I'll save it for later, but we're gonna try. So, my question for everyone is, what do you like to do in your free time, like as a hobby? Like when you have, you know, a day where you're like, I need some me time. What is something that you like to do? I like to go skating. I go and go into a local skating rink, putting on my four wheels, and then I just jam into the music. But... I haven't done that lately. I feel like I need to try and make a trip over there because I haven't done it in, in a little bit. Let's break off. Some of these were pretty big boys. But you peel. Not everyone likes to eat crawfish or crawdads because they don't like the process of doing it. But, you know, once you get the hang of it, you get these nice little pieces of meat. You have a nice dipping sauce. And I'm good. Here we go. Try that again. Hmm? Like, some people eat everything. I'm not one of those people. But, to each their own. But, anyways, let me know in the comments below what you like to do for fun or as a hobby. 
It can be sleep. It can be cook. Hang out with your kids, if you have kids. Uh, there's a couple of things. Well, let's just eat it as is. I know skating is one thing for me and I really want to try hiking. Right now in Arizona is probably a good time for me to try it because it's starting to get a little warm and you just you can't go like in the summertime. It's just bad. Got a nice little snow crab piece right there. Let's go with the jalapeno butter. Mm -hmm. Excellent choice. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Ooh, it's spicy. See? See that little piece right there? empty Let's see if I can do that again uh, no nope. couldn't do it again let's go let's see if we can get this video in under 20 minutes under 20 minutes while me talking and yapping I'm so sorry. I'm still a little under the weather. I have I have had a migraine, and I don't know if you've ever had a migraine or not before, but it's just like a headache 2.0. You know, it kind of just lingers. So mine is just like right here. So I'm fighting. I'm fighting. Mm. That was good. See, little piece. Oh, that's empty. I know I don't got to show you all of them, but. <laughs> Let's get here. Let's get here. And this is all seafood. No, uh, no potatoes. No corn, no sausage. Just, well, I guess crawfish is it? Is crawfish considered seafood? Huh. I actually don't know. I wouldn't think it's considered seafood because it's not found in the sea. But if you know, if you know, or if you're a fan of crawfish crawdads. Let me know. If you want to know what they taste like, it's like a mix between shrimp and lobster because it has like a nice little bite to it, but it has the, uh, like the texture of a lobster. Not too bad. This dude has some big claws. Pull it like that. Like that. And then we eat. Mm. Also, it was one pound of crawfish and it's going pretty fast one pound of crawfish uh, half a pound of shrimp and then just a, a cluster of a uh, snow 
seafood departments were kind of lacking when I went to go buy this. So I made do with what they had. Can I reach a jalapeno? Sorry, now I'm fixated on getting a jalapeno. Jalapeno, meat, crab meat. Mm. Mm. Ooh. That pepper packed a punch. Here we go. Here we go. Ooh. I'm trying to dip it in jalapeno butter, but. Mm. Never mind. Oh my goodness. That was good. Some more shrimp. At one point, I had found tiger shrimp. It all just disappeared. I can't find it anymore. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Scissors are gonna come in handy for this piece right here. There we go. Oh, let's get this nice little cartilage type piece. Come on, making me look like a chump. Mm-hmm. One. Got it. Mm. Love, love, love some snow crab. Boop, 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 boop. Another reason why I want to know what you do for fun is because I need some new things going on, you know? As long as it's not illegal, I'm down to try it. Cartilage peach piece was in there. Mm. <laughs> I got it. Wow. It's like a jumbo one. Should have probably shown you, but I'd already taken off its claws. Repeat. Oh, yeah. Dropping shells all over the place. And this was all made at Casa El or Casa de Sorelli. I wish I spoke Spanish. Because then I probably would have said it correctly. <laughs> Cluster. Oh, 
all that meat it's so i'm so sorry it's like so bright we are on the road to 5k i mean technically i have to reach 4k first so we're on the the road or the pit stop to 4k and then let's hit 5k because i'm so excited mm -hmm. oh yes I need to buy like a uh, one of those mini forks that helps you pick out like meat from like small or you know hard to reach places. Cause I don't want any of this to go to waste. But sometimes it's a little hard to get it out. There we go. But once you get in a rhythm, it's all good. Boom, 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 boom. Boop. Some potatoes and corn would have been nice right now, but I wanted to eat all my seafood. my seafood all right you don't see me struggling for the last minute with cluster put that to the side right now twist Eat. Look at this jumbo one. I'll save that one. Oh, that was spicy. Very spicy. But I can handle that spice. I should have got a smaller glass. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Whip, turn. Oh, didn't quite get that one. That's all right, though. Peel back and then just pull. Because somebody, some people eat the whole thing. Nothing wrong with that, I guess. It all tastes the same. In my opinion, anyway. That Cajun dip is really good. Empty. Small little claws. Small little claws. Ouch! Ouch! Oh. Mm. Wasn't successful with that one, but 
This one's putting up a fight anyway. It's so small. Good. Mm. Ooh, dripped a little bit. That's okay. Got it. Mm-hmm. Look at this one. This is that's a lobster right there. Got the whole claw. That's pretty good. Wah wah wee wah. Look at the size of this claw. This is from a crawfish. Crawdad. It's not from a lobster. Scissors for this right piece right there. Put up a little bit of a fight, no problem. This one's claw meat was a little tough. Not like tough to get out. Well, it was tough to get out. But it was tough like to the, to like the texture. Like, like claw jerky. Wah, wah, wee, wah. Look at this one. That's a trophy crawfish right there. All right. And come on out. Peel back. Ooh. Nice sized piece of meat. Mm. Did I have any? Oh, I had a little bit of cluster left over. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Pretty good. I didn't make the 20 minute mark. I passed it, but that's okay. Just wanted to do a quick little seafood boil uh, plus crawfish and crawdads. Never had that on my on my channel. I don't think ever. And uh, I like to eat them. You know, they I rarely get to eat them, so when I do, I enjoy them. Had a pound of it. I could have definitely eaten more. Um, I probably should have gotten more than a pound. Crab, shrimp. That's going to go ahead and do it. Please don't forget in the comments below, let me know what you like to do as a hobby. You know, that is legal. 
legal. Actually, you know what? Even if it is illegal, I'm curious. I want to know. It's, a, it's okay. I won't judge you. Uh, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe on the Sorelli East channel because we are eating over here. I love you all. Thank you so much. We hit 3K a couple of days ago, and I'm so excited. We're already on the road. Little pit stop to 4K, and then to 5K, 6K, 7K, 8K, 9K, 10K, all of the above. Um, I love you all. Thank you so much. Please don't forget, when I eat, you eat, we all eat together. Cue that outro. Peace.